Good afternoon, it's Nicholas from Gandora Gaming, and we have another broken-ass card coming out of OPO8, and honestly, I am terrified of this set. OPO7 looks like it's going to bring a lot of really cool new archetypes and new cards, but OPO8 looks like it's going to break the floodgates of the game. There are some really, really broken cards, especially in the color purple, and here is another brand new generic purple card. I already went over Black Maria. If you don't know, that card's absolutely stupid, and you can check out my video in the description. But uh, no, now today we have uh, Charlotte Linlin. She is the new purple nine cost character that I think will finally put purple yellow crocodile on the map. If not, then that deck does never is going to top. But uh, this this character is actually pretty insane. So uh, let's get into it. So first things first, this card is a nine cost character. 9,000 power, no counter. And then it has the ability on play, minus one dawn. Trash one card from your hand. Place one card on top of your deck to your life. So it heals you. Then you can place a six cost or lower opponent's character into their life. Basically saying for a cost of one dawn, well, technically it's a nine cost, so nine and minus one. Basically, you establish a boss monster, you heal yourself, and you get to put a six cost or lower character, most likely a blocker or opponent's like really good card, and just put it in their life. It's just like, yep, not only am I healing you, but I'm also removal. And you're probably saying, well, you are technically healing them. They will get that card back, thus it kind of balances it out. But don't forget this effect is optional. The uh, minus one to heal. And then if you want, put a six cost or lower back into your opponent's life. But also, sometimes that doesn't really matter. Because your opponent could have a mediocre board. You drop this thing, bounce their one blocker on back into the deck. And then whatever you have on field pushes for game that is a very very scary concept and the fact that this guy is a nine cost that heals you is absolutely terrifying especially if you're going into yellow purple uh yellow purple what's it called da -da -da -da, crocodile uh that leader is already pretty solid in opio 7 uh he has access to yamato he has access to 10 drop ace he has access to his in archetype heal card in Crocodile, the eight costs, and now he'll have access. Oh, he also has access to seven drop Linlin if they do play that one, and now he has access to nine drop Linlin. That is a lot of cards that can heal, and don't forget, Purple's whole gimmick is ramping, so you are just going to be ramping to get to ten dawn as quick as possible, and then just every turn dropping a heal card that is absolutely horrifying and don't forget charlotte uh pudding also is a leader so not only you gotta deal with uh yellow purple crocodile but you also have to deal with yellow purple uh, pudding who will also be able to play this card and she also has access to 10 drop linlin so that is like almost 12 cards that are like boss monsters that heal you now don't get me wrong not a lot of them don't have uh counter so that sucks. But you could just think of this 9-drop Linlin -lin as like a combination of Yamato and Katakuri. Oh, don't forget, you also have Katakuri who heals. Yes, you have to have another monster from field to heal yourself, but he's still a heal card. So you technically, if you really think about it, if you no, nah, you're not going to max out on all of these. You technically have 15 boss monsters in yellow-purple that heal you. That is 15 cards out of your 50 card deck that, if you play it, will give you another life. Now, some are a lot better than others. Kaya Curry kind of sucks because you had to put one of your own characters in your life, which, unlike the other ones that do it kind of for free, he has to put a character in your life. Uh, but he also is just removal because you put opponent's characters in your life, so that's also really good. You have access to two 10 drops, 10 drop Big Mom, and if she gets banned, you also have 10 drop Rush Ace that also heals you. Uh, you have also have access to now 7 drop Linlin -Lin and a uh, 9 drop Linlin, -Lin, the one we just are discussing now. And if you're Yellow Purple Crocodile, you don't have access to 10 drop Big Mom, but you do have access to 8 drop, uh, eight drop uh, 
uh, what's it called? Uh, crocodile that heals you. So this deck is just heal, 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 heal. And even if you don't think about yellow as a color, this gives every purple deck a heal card now. If you think about it, like purple Kaido can just play Lin Lin. And because it's generic, it doesn't say you need to have a Big Mom Pirate. That means every purple leader can just play nine drop Lin Lin and heal themselves. So before it was just yellow variants, you had to worry about healing yourself. But now every purple deck has a nine cost character that says, just give me another life. That is absolutely horrifying. And especially with the now Black Maria card that literally says, hey, on play, just gain five rest at dawn. That is absolutely horrible. That is horrifying. Not only are you just going to gain all this dawn back, but you can minus your opponent's life. Think about this. Think about this. You could nine drop into uh, Lin Lin, gain a life, use your effect, minus a life from your opponent. After you placed it one of their characters in their life. So you place a character in their life, then you use your ability to minus it. Then on the following turn, you play Black Maria. She gives you back five dawn. And then when the turn ends, you just cat your back to ten again and you just do it all over again. That is a very scary combination. Not to mention you still have access to nine drop Kaido. You still have access to all the other ten drop Kaido and all the new the new king that's also a rush card. There are some really, really scary cards going into purple, and I would be worried, especially I think about this. Uh, three, uh, it's called uh, red, bla uh, red, purple Luffy. That leader kind of sucks because he only has three life. Well, if you get to the later game, fuck Newgate, play this bitch, and you gain a life back. You just gain it. It's pretty solid. I don't know what else to say. I, I really think this card's really really good and you play blue purple kaido you can go sanji into lin 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 heal you you just establish two nine k's and heal yourself and remove an opponent's character that's six or less that's pretty fucking busted that's really busted uh i think this card is going to be absolutely critical and it's gonna be really really good so uh that's really all i got hope you all enjoy don't do anything stupid and i'll see you on the next one Bye bye <laughs>